Hey everybody, Pampered Chef Kathleen here. I want to welcome you to dinner. I get to use my deluxe cooking blender tonight. Okay, I really, really am fighting the urge to just make caramel and eat that with apples for dinner. But I'm going to make some butternut squash soup first, right? Doesn't that sound so good and so folly and I love it. I love it. Anyway, I haven't made it before, so you get to come with me while I make it. All right, I want to show you how stupid easy it is. Okay, first of all, let me tell you about my new best friend. Okay, so this is our cooking blender. So this cooks not with friction, but with an actual heating element. Okay, this can get up to 220 degrees. One of the main reasons why the canister, the pitcher is glass and not plastic, like some of the others on the market. Okay, so it's not going to gray or shade or fog over time, it's glass, okay? And it gets really hot so it keeps your soups like, I mean, you'll see it bubbling. It's amazing, right? So super safety features, which I also love, okay, it's got a knuckle guard here, okay? Because again, it gets hot, right? So it also has a helper handle to lift the base, which is super wonderful. And it has a sensor in the lid. So, is it on? Yes, it's on. If the lid is not engaged properly, it won't turn on. It sings to me. Sing me a song. Anyway, um, so yeah, amazing, right? And it's got eight pre-programmed settings. Okay, dummy settings, if you will, right? So you can make your smoothies, you can make alternate milks in here. You can make, you know, your cashew milk, your oat milk, your almond milk. How amazing is that? Save money in the store. Don't go buy that crap with all that other stuff in it. Make your own, right? So it's got that. It's got a grind setting. What can you make in the grind setting? Well, the best peanut butter ever. Three cups of peanuts. That's it. Throw it in here, it gets its grind on, and it grinds them and crushes them into the smoothest peanut butter. It's amazing. Um, what else? You can do your coffee beans and have fresh coffee beans. You can grind fresh um, Parmesan. All right, you throw a couple of cubes in here, brrr, fresh. Can't get any better than that, okay? Tremendous. What else we got? We've got the soup and the jam settings. Those are two patent pended settings. Okay, they'll be exclusive to Pampered Chef, which is phenomenal. And it crushes everything and grinds it and cooks it down and it blends it so it is a smooth, buttery soup and sauce and it is so terrific. You don't have to pre-cook your vegetables, you don't have to steam them, you don't have to blanch them. Throw them in raw. That's what we're gonna do tonight. We're gonna throw in butternut squash some seasonings, a few carrots, some broth, and a little apple. That's it, pretty much it, I'm pretty sure. Anyway, um, what else we got? Oh my God, so much fun. You wanna know what else? It cleans itself. So if you're making your peanut butters or, oh, I made chocolate mousse in here the other night. Oh my God, it was so good. It's ridiculous. Um, yeah, so you can take whatever you want out of your blender throw in three cups of water and just two drops of dish detergent. Press a button, walk away. That's what I love. You walk away and it does the work for you, whether it's cooking your food or cleaning itself. Okay, tremendous, it's so exciting. Anyway, without further ado, let's get cooking, all right? So we're gonna just do this super quick. We're gonna throw in about three cups of butternut squash, all right? So I just took a butternut squash here and I'm just gonna put it in some rough chunks, literally, like these big silly chunks. All right, I'm gonna use the Santuco knife, which I love. This is part of their forged cutlery. You see the divots in it? That's so things don't stick to it. So it's pretty delicious. And I am going to, how much more am I gonna do? I don't know, it says three cups, but I always go over, All right? Because more is always better. All right, that's probably about good. And you can rough chop it, you know what I'm saying? Here we go. Three cups of that. What else does it call for? It calls for two and a half cups of liquid. You can use water, you can use vegetable broth, you can use chicken broth, that's what I'm using. All right, so you got two and a half cups of that. 
is my batter bowl. Love this thing. Oh my gosh, it holds so much and it's so convenient with that handle. All right, two and a cup, half cups. We've got brown sugar, salt, and cinnamon. Okay, I just threw that in here all together. Just gonna literally drop it in. Okay, um, we've got ginger I gotta put in. Quarter cup of ginger, I mean, oh my God, a quarter cup. Quarter teaspoon. Okay, where am I at here? My quarter teaspoon. Okay, so I'm using these flexible, I'm sorry, not flexible, adjustable measuring spoons. Super, super convenient, okay? Because you just slide the bar and you get all your measurements, okay? So you have two spoons instead of like 12 in your drawer because we all need more drawer space, right? We know this. All right, where are we going? A quarter? All right, let me scoop it in here to the ginger. We're all good. Oh my God, let's, let's put a little extra in there because it's ginger. And it's delicious. All right, what else we got in here? Um, blah, blah, blah. Two medium carrots. So I had baby carrots, so yeah, I think that's about two medium carrots, right? And uh, la, 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 garlic. I'm gonna throw some garlic in here. That one's already peeled. So I have a garlic press and I have a garlic slicer. This piece, this silicone sleeve goes with the garlic slicer. Okay, so that basically takes off your skin. You just put it in here. You hear it crackle? That's the skin popping off. It's crackling off. There. No skin. No fuss. Okay, so we've got our garlic in there and we've got some dried apples. Now it says to dice them, but I don't know, that's kind of silly because it's going to grind it up. So I just literally took some apple and I'm throwing it in there. All right, easy peasy. That's how I like it. All right, and that's it. Oh, I forgot the onion. Hello. All right, so I had a half an onion left over, which is kind of perfect. And that's all I'm gonna do with it. All right, it's a little full. I probably have too much in there. Well, it closes so it works, all right? All right, so let's see. And then I'm gonna turn it to, oh, I'm gonna turn it to the Zoom setting. Press the button, walk away. It's gonna give a little zhuzh and then it's gonna start heating up the vessel. All right, so I think the whole thing takes like 30 minutes, but the best thing is, like you say, you dump it and you forget it. All right, and wait till, well, I wish we had smell a vision All right, obviously you can't smell it, but it's gonna be delicious. All right, ah, oh, I'm exhausted. I think I need a nap. See you guys later, bye. And now it'll start heating up and then it'll, you know, every, every minute or so it'll zhuzh it around and oh my God, I can't wait for dinner. What are you guys having? Let me know. Bye.